<laughs> How's it going guys? Today I'm gonna show you my personal top 10 game rule commands in Minecraft, with which you can alter game settings to achieve really useful and cool stuff like this. If you liked the video, please hit that subscribe button and without any further ado, let's jump right into it. Alright guys, first things first, number 10. On number 10 we have the command slash game rule spawn radius and the default value is 10. The default value um, determines how how big the radius is in which you spawn when you get killed. Slash kill, as you can see, we land approximately outside the circle which is 10 blocks. But if we type in 1 now and press done, if we kill ourselves now, we will always land on this block in the middle. This works every time. Which is really cool because then you can build like nice structures around your spawn point and you can have like a beacon or something in the middle. Alright, let's get to the next one. Rolling in hard on number 9 is the command slash game rule to mob loot falls. It's a really specific command because if we go to this creeper and press this button this creeper will not drop anything as you can see we have a looting th looting three sword but he will not drop anything because we've disabled it well why would you do that it's really useful if you have giant and big farms and you want to test them the exact rates and you want to enable the mob loots at an exact point so you can measure like really long time periods like if you want to measure 24 hours you can just start and stop it whenever you want okay let's get to the next one sitting on the number eight there's the command slash game rule do insomnia false what this does is it disables phantom spawning so these little pesky guys will no longer spawn in your world which is quite nice because I hate them. Next up, we have my favorite command. It is slash game rule random tick speed and the default value is 3. If we add a number like 3000 here, stuff will start growing really really fast. For example, as you can see everything is growing at a phenomenal speed. Be careful to revert it because it can cause some issues. On number 6 we have the command slash game rule mob griefing true. What this does, you can already guess, is if we activate this it will, the creeper will blow up, blow up the landscape but if we type in false and activate it and go into survival mode, creeper will explode. You can see it did no damage to the dirt. This uh, also applies to Enderman, uh, but be careful because villagers can no longer pick up food. On the number 5 we have the command slash game rule do fire tick false. What this does is it allows us to lay fire and stuff will not burn. For example if we do this it will never disappear. Fire doesn't destroy wood anymore. This is really useful if you build like um, a furnace or something and you don't want your whole house to burn. So I think it's quite nice. The command place in number 4 is the command slash game rule do mob spawning false. What this does is it disables all mob spawning. For example sheep and horses and stuff like that cannot spawn anymore. To show you, if we set it to true and hit the button. Uh, after a few seconds, sheep and horses should spawn. Slimes go first, of course, but let's see. In a few seconds, we should see there they are a lot of mobs. Nice. Alright, guys, we are now down to the top three uh, game rule commands in Minecraft. These are the commands that you generally want to activate in every world if you want to play with them. They are really really useful and all in all really really handy. Okay, so the first one on number three is slash game rule do daylight cycle false. 
you can already guess, it disables that the sun is moving. It's really really nice if you have a, like a redstone world or this flat world, if you don't have to type in time set day every time. Okay, so I think it's pretty useful. On the number 2 we have the command slash game rule keep inventory true. It's pretty self explanatory. If you just grab ourselves a block pallet and kill ourselves, we will respawn with all our items intact. Trust me, it can save you a lot of annoyance. And on number one, my top command is my favorite thing and I activate it in every world because what it does, it deactivates the weather cycle. Slash game rule, do weather cycle false. It will never rain again. <sighs> I hate rain in Minecraft so much. It's so loud. I thank the heavens for this command. <sighs> my absolute favorite. Alright guys, this concludes this quick video. I hope you enjoyed it and if so, please consider to vandalize that like and subscribe button. If you have any video ideas you want to see in the future, let me know down in the comment section. Thanks for your support and I'm out. For example, 3... Well, slash game rule, do map. Next up is the number 10. And oh for fuck's sake!